up gamers welcome to the channel and what we're going to be looking at in this video real quick is what's going to be going on this next week in grand theft auto 5 so let's check it out right now is it looks like we are getting a brand new vehicle which is going to be the bravado buffalo evx which is going to be probably located i don't know we'll find it though won't we all right, you guys, so the next thing that we're going to be getting here is it looks like weekly unlocks. Now, I don't know if you guys already have these liveries for your Avenger, but these are going to be some, looks like, free unlocks just for logging in, I can imagine. So, we have the pink and green camo, the Santa Capra coins, and the dollar dollar liveries for the Mammoth Avenger, which should be absolutely free. Now, this next week, we got our, well, t later on tonight, basically, we have ourselves a brand new event that's going to be happening, and it's going to be lasting all the way until July 12th. So, let's go over some of this stuff, because a lot of this stuff is going to be some rare clothing in the game, potentially, that you guys can be getting. All right, so, first things first is buy, or already own, which is going to be the operational terminal in the Mammoth, uh, and the thruster upgrades for the Mammoth Avenger. So you have to have the terminal and the thruster to go ahead and get this bomber jacket, which is the, what is it? The Hinter, Hinterland? Hinterland bomber jacket. Okay. And then right here it says, sell a half of a million dollars worth of smuggler cargo. That's over at our hangar now. And for that, we're going to be getting a pounder's cap. So there's going to be like a hat for that one. And then complete all six Project Overthrow missions to go ahead and get a blue and green camo livery for the Mammoth Avenger. And then the last one here is going to be uh, complete the three LSA operations, which is going to be on the terminal too. It's those three. Uh, and then for that, we're going to be getting a Conbrierier livery. For the Molotov, I don't even know. I want to do that just to go ahead and try to, like, see what that livery looks like. I'll, I'll end up probably looking it up where you guys can. All right, but anyways, from there, it looks like we got some triple cash and triple RP on new community series jobs. So we'll, we'll have to check that out and see if there's anything in there worth grinding at all. But, okay, then it uh, looks like, so, times and a half on the Project Overthrow missions, which is going to be starting, you know, later on tonight. So we'll be earning an extra 50% bonus out of that. So discounts, we got 40% off the Bravado Gauntlet Classic discounts. Also 30% off of the Buckingham uh, Milljet. And then it's uh, the Italian or the Italy RSX. And then also the Mammoth Module or Mog Magu, Mugu. Well, I don't know. We can figure it out. And then also we have the Nero. All those are going to be 30% off. And then free vehicles here this next week. Over at the Diamond Casino, looks like we're going to be looking at the Timsta, which is a pretty nice car. Definitely worth going over there every day and trying to win that thing. And then for the prize ride vehicle, we have the Turismo Classic, which is going to be placed top two in LS Car Meet races for four days in a row so you have to get like second place or better for four days in a row in the ls car meet stuff and then premium races uh this next week is going to be for the time trial uh looks like the sawmill and then for the hsw time trial is del piro beach and then there's a whole array of test ride vehicles now that are showing up at the new car club place at uh i would say simeon's and then everywhere else that there's going to be test rides basically you know the ls car meet and stuff like that so it looks like this next week they're wanting us to grind these new overthrow missions which uh replay value in my opinion is not necessarily the best there's not really like a storyline to any of this if you call this a dlc but i'm going a little bit far-fetched here uh really not the best but anyways from there you guys yep it looks like this is what's happening this next week in grand theft auto 5 so potentially we can prepare for some of these events and then i will be making separate videos talking about how we're actually going to be getting this clothing and how to go ahead and do that once again this next week probably and then also talking about you know hopefully there's going to be a good triple cash and triple rp community job that they'll be putting in the game which most of those are just races anyways but anyways from there you guys yep looks like this is what's happening this next week in grand theft auto 5 if you guys ended up enjoying the video and it was helpful hit like button below subscribe for new content leave a comment letting us know what you guys think about this week uh coming up here in a few hours but from there you guys thanks for watching my name is gravesite i'll see you in the next one so peace